Hello everyone, my name is Walida Shibli. I am an environmental engineer in the Environment Authority and I am working in the environment now for since three years. Since the Environment Authority has been established, our main goal was to protect the Omani environment and uh, to create a better environment for the Omani people. We are here today to release one big project and this project is a survey of perennial trees. The aim of this project to do a survey for these old trees within the Omani environment. We have searched for many typical or traditional ways how to conduct this uh, project. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. I am Khalifa bin Saeed Al Ma'mari, from the Idaris Shemal Al Batma. I will give you a little bit of the trees. The trees are the trees. The trees are the trees for the trees. The trees are the trees for the trees. And the trees are the trees for the trees. تغفية جمالية للبيئة وهي ملاذ للحياة الفطرية وكذلك تكون لها غذاء سابقا في الأعمال المسح البيئي يستخدم الطرق الراجلة والتصوير اليودي والآن نستخدم الطريقة التقنية اللي هي الطائرات My name is Rashid Al-Musulhi from GIS Hub I'm proudly introducing our latest project in collaboration with the Environment Authority in Oman our main goal is to create a comprehensive database of these vitzel trees. And these trees play a significant role in our ecosystem. Our team uses advanced technology to capture high quality data. We are using uh, different tools, for example, M350 using uh, H20 lens. Also, especially, we are using a comprehensive drone, which is uh, M3M. It gives us uh, multiple data. RGB and multispectral. Also, it gives us uh, centimeter level accuracy. We visited each site to record topographical features like elevations and slopes. We identified tree types and noted their species and distribution. Using GDPS devices, we documented key coordinates to guide our drone flights, ensure accurate mapping up to 2 cm, and setting a solid foundation for the upcoming aerial surveys. On the second day, we performed mission planning on the DJ Pilot 2 application on RC Pro involves checking the precise location in the forest and collecting the data using Mavic 3M and Metric 350 drones equipped with H20 multispectral and RGB sensors. After successful drone operation, we collected all required data. After processing the data with Geospectral software, we have generated 2D maps, 3D model of the site. This model provides real-time visualization, monitoring the site for urban infrastructure planning and feature identification. Processing the data with high-end machine, we generated 3D point cloud data, which provides detailed topographical analysis and tracking precise measurements of the site, like spacing between the trees, calculating areas, measurement of the selected areas, and also height of the trees. As you can see, red areas shows most high vegetation. Also, we created digital elevation models and digital surface models which help us providing detailed insight of the terrain analysis and slope analysis. For multispectral data, we calculated various vegetation indicates like NDVI to assess the health of the tree. Red indicates healthy trees, young trees like trees in the growing stage, while green shows unhealthy trees. Through the color differences, we can monitor the status of the health of vegetation. As you can see in the 2D map, we have one healthy and other unhealthy tree. Multispectral data allow us to identify which trees need more attention. We also use agricultural software to count trees and measure the areas for agricultural monitoring like spraying. And we found that using drones is the, is, it's a high efficient way to do it. Because of using drones, uh, we have time saving, a high quality shooting, we have a high quality database by the cooperation of Environment Authority in the North Albatina and GIS hub company, we will create a database for this perennial trees, which will help the authority to save these trees for the next generations.